Good morning, everybody. Gosh, it's been a hot minute, I know. You know, we were moving, getting adjusted, all that stuff. I um, am going to give you guys a deep house tour today. First, mama needs to get her hair did because it's been way too long, as you can tell. I got to run a few errands. I gotta go pay the last power bill from the old house. I've got to run to the garbage place and get garbage pickup set up at the new house and something else. Oh, I gotta go to the post office. After I get my hair did, and get those errands ran we're going to shoot back to the house and i'm going to give you guys a deep house tour as well as the property it is already 60 here today so it's perfect day to get the kids outside and give you guys a property tour as well now i'm going to get this took care of we'll see what it look like when i come out bam i feel so much better my hair was in desperate need y'all I love it. I wished I could curl my hair. I cannot curl my hair. I would wear my hair like this all the time. I don't know what it is. I've tried to curl my hair. I just ain't figured it out yet. Like why? I can do almost everything in life, but I cannot curl my hair. But I'm so happy. I love it. Feel better. Now I got to do all the fun stuff. I got to go to the license, go get my license switched, new address, go to the garbage company pay a few bills and then we'll see y'all back at the house because it is gorgeous and it's warm look 66 here today that makes kentucky right now feel like it's 80 so yeah but let's go get these bills took care of does daddy do good breakfast does daddy do good breakfast little girl well you think about it bud is it pretty good so as y'all know little mama's out getting her hair did and i'm doing breakfast i went down to wendy's if you've not tried Wendy's breakfast, I have to tell you, it's pretty good. Their sausage and egg biscuits are phenomenal. You like it, don't you, Moo? Daddy. And I think today I'm going to work on the building to get the business back home. It just, it needs to be here. Because I think I've realized something, like, we've tried to do the video separate and do, like, the split vlogs, and I just muted that. Back on puppy pals didn't want to let go. Like I said, we've tried to do the split videos and the split vlogs and this and that. And it just don't work for some reason. Maybe we have a little bit of a codependent relationship when it comes to the fact of doing videos. Because I was sitting there looking back through the channel. And long as me and little mama was in the same house, videos was pretty regular. But then I also noticed like... When I split and I had to go down work, I stayed so busy. Most of the time I get down there at the store at like 7.30, 8 o'clock, and I'm there till 5, 5.30. And it makes it so hard, you know, to come home because I want to come to the house and spend a little bit of time with the kids, spend a little time with little mama, and it, it does make it, you know, rough to get these videos done. Guys, we've got so many unfinished videos, but they're like four or five minutes long. And I think she just... She gets discouraged because I'm not home to interact with. You know, when we started this, it's always been me and her. And at the times that we went apart, the videos seemed to lack. So we're going to try this again, see how this works. Me be right outside. That way, when it's nap time or something, I come in, help little mama put the kids down. Then I can go back out there and work a little bit. Kind of free, help free her time up a little bit. Free up my time. Maybe I'll go out and work in the evening, getting your guys' shirts out. I'm going to come up with a plan that works. I hope. Where are you going? Where are you going, girl? Just do it. Get back up and do it. There you go. There you go, Moo Moo. You so proud of yourself, ain't you? <laughs> that was a run. That wasn't a walk. That was a run. How'd you do that? How did you do it? You're getting too big, little girl. You shouldn't be walking at 10 months old. It just shouldn't happen. What do you think about it, buddy? You about to have somebody to play with now. All right, kids are fed, living room's clean. Well, somebody's already working on destroying the living room, mister. No, you ain't getting a remote. You need to sit down, where'd you go? Say hi. What are you hiding for? He knows he ain't supposed to have this camera. Say, it's, don't take abuse like the GoPro does it. Do you miss it? Are you wild? Are you waiting on mama get home? You don't want mama home? You like daddy being home? 
You like Daddy being home? Yeah, I know Moo Moo does. I can't knock her off of me. So you're a dad ass girl. Take dad dad. And now all there is left to do is sit here and chill with these children and wait for little mama to get home. Ain't that right? Say, come on, mama, we meet you. Say, we meet you, mama. What is it? What is it? How did you get those? You always get stuff, and I don't even know where it comes from. Who is it? Is it mama? Say, where are you going? Say, you backed up to the door for some reason. Come here, she's over here. Oh, no. Why did you back up to the door? Because I have groceries. Even when I get groceries, I still park in the carport and I walk them. I wanted them. to make it easier on you, but next time I will just yeah. park in the carport and you can walk extra. Okay, your curtains come in. Good. So did my jacket. And I don't know, but I found your daughter chewing on this. You know why? Because the cat. My cat, y'all, between my kids and the cats, I give up on the tree. Moo Moo! You get your man. Mm -hmm. No, she hey, does. Hey, big girl. Mommy's got to get out of these clothes like now. Your hair looks nice. Thank you very much. Little mama's playing one of my tricks. Come on, guys. I was getting ready to go work on the shop, and then she comes out here and grabs the leaf blower. Look at a wild turkey. <sighs> Y'all, it is a beautiful day in Kentucky. Look at this. 60 degrees. Moo Moo, what do you think about it, girl? Do you need help? Oh, you seen that ass? <laughs> what are you doing? You're needed. I'm always needed. <laughs> Sounds like somebody's in trouble. You know, I love the fact you want to run. <laughs> that we are in the last house in a holler. We know everybody below us. <laughs> I'm fixing to take you in the house. A little, a little. You're like the dog, the, I was gonna say dog wrangler, but you're wrangling dogs and humans and cats and you're just the wrangler. So we've got most of the leaf problem took care of. I knew there was gonna be more, but I needed to get the biggest part gone. I raked them down and we burn them right in the creek here. Darkened out the sun. For real, for real. Yeah, it's taking care of leaves day. Luckily I got this nice little creek beside the house now. I got my buddy Timbo up there somewhere blowing. You can't see him. See, there he is. But we've got both sides of this all cleared up. Burn them old leaves right in the creek where they sit. And no, we're in Kentucky. It just rained yesterday, so there's no burn ban right now. So I'm burning the leaves. I mean, little mama's got a good plan we want to put an effect up here. The first spot I cleared out. Y'all check this out. <laughs> you gotta push him. <laughs> He's trying to figure the petals out. What do you think about it, buddy? He gets mad when you take it. <laughs> Y'all, this girl is getting heavy, let me tell you. Right here, we we're wanting to build us a little, just kind of a quiet spot. You know, maybe a place we can come read our Bible, pray, just think, kind of get back in touch with ourselves. That's a pretty good little level spot. Be a nice place to put just maybe a little, just a bench or something. Something to set on with a little lean-to. I mean, look at this. This creek runs down through here real nice and pretty. I love this little area right here. I could actually dam this up, make this water flow a little better. Was you trying to film Moo Moo? You see yourself? Tell him. Mm. <laughs> what? Why are you being shy? 
I swear I'm in love with this backyard. This is all I ever wanted for these babies. Thank you, Lord. You ever seen a man four-wheel on a tricycle? I guess we have now. four-wheeler's got crops. Actually, it's a five-wheeler. What's up, buddy? Okay, we're hug. I don't know. Hug! Do you think that dog can hear you? Where you going, Moo? Come here. Hey, say, I love you. <laughs> Did you find a ball? Jeremiah's standing down there. He ain't about to walk up here. Where do you think you're going, mister? No. I said, no, I don't think so. Come here. Get up to her. Moo Moo's up there eating leaves. Go check her out. Go check on Moo Moo. <laughs> he said hi. Now it's supposed to be pretty Saturday and God willing, it holds out. I'm gonna go up this way and back through the head of this holler. I'm gonna film a new Bigfoot Chronicles Saturday. Like I said, as long as the weather holds out. This mountain is the same exact mountain that all that happened on. We're literally a thousand yards from our property. Go. Ah! Ooh, he's being wild. You need help up? Where are you going? But this right here is the lowest point of that mountain. My property is just on the other side of that hill. So all this comes back and it empties down right into the head of here. So this is the holler for all of that mountain. So I'm going to venture back in there and see if I can find something. Why not? I've walked all that. And then once I do this, I may walk from here over to there and see if I can see anything. Because I've never been this far on that side of the property. Where do you think you're going? Get up there, check on Moo Moo. Go check on your Moo Moo. Go, go check on her. Okay, now here's the conundrum I'm in. This is actually the second time I had to film this because this camera done the one thing that I, the reason why we quit using it, it did the whole uh, memory card error thing. That's why we quit using the G7 and we started, you know, kind of going over to the GoPros. I'm a GoPro fan. I do like the Canon cameras. I love their color and everything, but this one has issues. Already out of warranty, whatever. It's neither here nor there. So when we first moved into this house, we had a real big influx of storage. It all landed up here. Every single thing, which given a lot of this is my office stuff, it all landed up here. So now I've got to figure out what to do with this mess. I've got to get some light bulbs for this because these won't work with just one. So I gotta get another light bulb for that. This table, I'm actually tearing out of here I don't think it's going to be a use for me. It's really wide. There's no way little mama could reach the back of that. She'd have to stand on a stepping stool and climb on it. So I'm going to tear that out. And I'm going to build something like this on this very end from that door frame over. And that's going to be my pre-treatment booth. Then I'm going to set the heat press right here. Going to do shelves on this side in front of that door because I'm blocking that door off. This area right here is going to be for the printer. My desk is gonna be right in front of this window here. Once I get that window cleaned and everything, look at this view I'll have every day. Look at that, y'all. Now that is a work view if you've ever had one. I am going to get on cleaning this mess. I'm not gonna do any kind of crazy uh, edit and montage because the lighting's awful in here. Like I said, I've got this one light at the moment. I gotta do a lot with the light, and I got a lot to do with this to get ready, so. I'd rather work, get it done. That way I can do future content than just using me cleaning this as content. So I'm gonna get this done as soon as I get where I'm at. I'll show y'all an update. All right, so this is a nuisance. The light blowed. My little cordless vacuum cleaner there. Yeah, it went dead. And I would filmed a whole nother part. Talking, was in a little better spirits, but then the camera did the memory card error thing, so. Is what it is though. 
I got everything moved down. I got most of it vacuumed. Now I got to get the carpet shampooer, get up here and shampoo the carpet, get everything ready. Like I said, it don't stink up here. It's just, you can tell it's been shut up for a while. The lady used it as a flower shop. It's a real nice building. It's dry, there's no mold. It's gonna take a little bit of work. I hope I didn't lock my keys in there. What are you doing? Taters in a pot. Here, 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 here. There you go. <laughs> Turd. Hey guys, it is many hours later. I'm whispering because both my chicklets are asleep. So I'm getting dinner going. Yes, I just splashed water everywhere, but I got itty bitty baby taters cooking. These green nuggets are going to the trash. They're green. Yum. Got chicken breast smothered in cream of chicken, mushrooms, green pepper or green onions, bacon, um, salt, pepper, garlic, Italian seasoning. Got that going in the oven. I'm gonna make another side, but I have not decided what yet. So. Oh God. How did I know? How did I know that's what you were gonna say? Macaroni and cheese and ain't had it in like weeks. Sean, you lie. We had it for Thanksgiving. Oh, no, we didn't. I oh. got the video proof. Oh, I didn't make it? No. Oh. Whoops. Y'all know I don't care about macaroni and cheese. He loves it. Two boxes, please. Here, throw these green nuggets in the garbage. Y'all, I'm learning with this glass stove top. Like it's it. the never ending, I don't want to shine. I don't like it. We're getting a regular <laughs> stove top. They sell them. I'm getting a regular stove top. I don't like it. Can't use cast iron on it. You got to be like, Zip. yeah, no. yeah. It, you can use cast iron, but you have to be so careful, and you do take the risk of busting the glass. So we, it ain't happening. But anyways, look, and it works, y'all. I was petrified to use this because of an experience in the past. I just done it. I was like, listen, if it don't work, it we know <laughs> if it works, then it makes life easier. Yeah. Sean just winged it. I was like, <gasps> because no I had a bad lie. experience no, with no one. Because I'm the risk taker. Yeah, he is. I'm not. I, I like things the way they are. And if I know it's good, it's good. If it, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. That's how my motto goes. But anyways, it works. Y'all, my hands. I know I've said this before on video. My hands are, a, I look like they've been through the grinder. Like, I mean, my hands are so dry and cracked. You probably can't tell, but they are. Trust me, they hurt so bad all the time. And Sean was like, just try it, just try it. And I'm like, what happened? At one of our old places, the dishwasher, I ran it and it backed literal poo up into my kitchen sink. I guess it was connected to, I don't know, some pipe that everything, the poo flowed in. It, it was traumatizing. And uh, I've never ran one since. So, Sean broke that habit with me. Now have a dishwasher. Yay. But anyhow, I'm going to show you guys the house quietly while the kids are asleep. Now, everything is still a work in progress. I think Sean done showed y'all the property. This is our absolute of a disaster laundry room right now which we've been outside you can see chloe little that's her outside booties because they're super warm but we've been outside today shoes in and out i'm doing laundry overflow stuff those curtain rods will be getting hung up in the bedroom in a little bit yeah it, it's a mess the living room and of course you know it. We've got our Ten Commandments there. This little cubby hole, I don't know why it's there, but it works perfect for our lamp. <laughs> Soon to be him in his apparel. Puppy. Puppy. Mama. I still gotta find a spot to hang this. Eventually, the cabinets are either gonna be completely changed out or we're gonna be doing them white and put new knobs on everything. Probably new countertops too, because I don't know if you can tell the, I guess the top coat is starting to come. These are, these probably have been in here since this house was built. 
but it stains almost everything you sit on it. So I think they're they're wearing down. But this living room is still what we're picking out of and bringing throughout the house. Some of it's going to the building. Sean is working on and cleaning right now, so it's in here. That way it's not exposed out in the weather until he gets the building done. And then a lot of that will go up for the shop. In Bubba's live man's room, as you can tell, he's been having a good old time in here. Him and Cece. These curtains are fixing to go. These were here when we moved in. I just washed them and put them back up. But they don't match his comforter. So I found a set on Amazon. Y'all, my ear. Every year, my ear. I'm gonna have to go have it checked. For some reason, this is Colton's little bathroom buddy. He bats it every time he washes his hands and brushes his teeth. But, you know, basic little bathroom. His little potty. He's learning. And my potatoes. They'll be done any minute, but I'm gonna get supper done. Get Sean's mac and cheese on and Colton's. And uh, we'll come back when all this is ready. And I don't have to whisper. Man, I don't know what's going on in here, but I'm digging it. What do you mean? Got some taters and some macaroni and cheese. Y'all, I'm like a macaroni and cheese bandit. I will eat it all. Tag on that chicken looking scrumptious. What are you doing, Moo? Cut ready for nummies. Buddy. Daddy, he's got Sissy's passy. He's still sleepy. Yeah. I think it's time for a haircut. <gasps> Do you need a haircut? No. No. Oh, oh. You sure? I think you might. He, he's getting pretty long here. He's getting pretty long here. If you'd be a good boy at the barber, we could take you to the barber, but... Moo Moo, you're lucky. It won't be haircut time for you for many, many, many years. Nope. Mommy's going to let it grow and grow. As long as you don't put bubble gum or something in your hair. Oh, shit. Yeah. Peanut butter. Peanut butter does the trick. Y'all know I'm telling the truth. Peanut butter will bring it out. You need some nummies. Do you want some nummies? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she's already looking at the kitchen. 